The AI race, which in recent years has been tapped as the catalyst for a global multi-billion dollar AI data center infrastructure boom, is finding itself at a crossroads. A series of developments have now thrown into question the entire investment story. So, how did we get here and what does it mean for Malaysia? So this week, I wrote about the latest development on the AI race, particularly DeepSeek, um, a new LLM model from China, uh, which uh, the developers claim to uh, run on less computing power or don't require as much, uh, or don't require the fastest chips to, to compete with the um, Western counterparts. So uh, this is a uh, important information because. Uh, for example, Malaysia, we have been riding on the assumption that computing power is needed uh, in this AI race and Malaysia can provide that. So we are seen as part of the value chain. For example, Malaysia companies produce uh, or manufacture or assemb assemble the servers and we also get the chips and lease it out to the hyperscalers, those that want the computing power. So if that demand changes, then the story becomes much less exciting um, for the investment case. So, um, because of that, um, the valuation premium that has been given to these companies uh, has been narrowed down, which hence um, the sell down. Yeah. It should be noted that the share price of many of these AI-related companies were already on a run since 2024 and valuations are still higher than historical levels. But the situation continues to evolve and the goalposts continue to shift, such as the revelation that DeepSeek might actually use more chips than originally thought. So uh, at this moment, the situation is still fluid. A lot of things have yet to be firmed out. Information about DeepSeek and all the other China-based LLMs um, are still, you know, are still coming out. So uh, still have to watch it.